This video covers setting up the connections in Harmer. This video is designed to complement the Harmer manual. You can launch Harmer in standalone mode by clicking the image line icon. In this mode, you have a few extra controls at the very top for output level, audio and MIDI setup, and controls for tempo that let you tap it in, type it in, and adjust it incrementally. You also have the help menu. If you click on the audio button, you have the option to call up an on-screen keyboard which can easily resize and scroll. You can also open the audio settings window and select your audio interface. You can set the sample rate and 44.1 should work fine for most projects. You can also choose a latency value. Latency is the slight delay needed by your PC to do synthesis calculations. Lower latency values are preferred for live performance, but if you dial it down too low, you may start to hear pops and glitches. Latency values around 400 to 800 samples should be so slight that you won't notice, but still give your computer room to work. The more powerful your PC is, the lower you can set your latency without suffering audio glitches. Generally, there's no need to go below 400 samples. You can select your MIDI device and configure the input and output signal flow. When you open Harmer as a plugin, all of these functions are controlled by the host program. Now that we have Harmer connected, let's go to the next video and start exploring how it works. For more great software, visit the ImageLine online shop. And for more tutorials, visit the ImageLine YouTube channel.